So we're not allowed to fly this thing because of Nevada state law. We're here at CES in Las Vegas, Nevada. But can you show me some of the design aspects? Sure. So Lily is ultra compact. It's waterproof. Uh, the folding props make it really small and portable. As soon as you throw it in the air, it starts flying. The props open up and it, it works. It flies. Um, there's a bottom facing camera, a sonar, and the front facing camera here for tracking. And of course, the little eyes here, uh, they're status LEDs, uh, but they're really cute and it makes the product very personable. I see a face yes. in there. The lily, lily face. Yeah, so so how far reaching can this camera, is it like 180 degrees or what's so the range? So it's about 120 degrees. It flies from five to 100 feet from the user. We realize that the best shots are really within the 40 to 20 feet range because it's really close and very immersive. The tracking device here is used for tracking. So you put it on you and Lily will know who you are. And it also records sound. So for the first time you have aerial footage with sound from within the scene. I mean, is it like, is it microphone quality? It's like a point and shoot camera. Okay, so you really could use this to just get your own footage yes, anywhere. Yes, definitely. And the tracking device also records information about how you're moving in the world. There's initial sensors there that tell Lily your acceleration, your speed. So for example, if you're jumping, Lily can slow-mo the video automatically for you. Can you upload that in real time or is that not a feature yet? Yeah, so there's a companion app on your iPhone and Android phones um, that shows all the contents and it's connected via uh, Wi-Fi. I hear you guys are selling a lot of these on pre-order. Yes, so we launched a pre-order campaign on May 12, 2015 and we did $34 million in pre-sales in 2015. $30 million. $34 million. $34 million in 2015. In 2015, that's about 60,000 units. That's a lot of units. It's been great. We had traction all over the world, here in Europe, in China. Uh, we've been fortunate to have so much traction and engagement from our early customers. Do you think some of that has to do with the, the everyone wants a drone? I or, think. Excuse me, oh, you call it a camera, not a drone. It's a thank you, camera, but it looks like a drone. Yeah. I think we. We've built a camera uh -huh. that has a form factor of a flying robot. Are you going to have to go through FAA reg regulations? Yes, and we recommend our users to get the license, uh -huh. you know, or pay five dollars um, to get the license. This okay. Is definitely, yeah, in the category. However, it's completely legal. It flies below 400 feet. It's always in line of sight, and you can manually take control using the tracking device. And you guys won. Uh, you already won a CES award this year. Yes, in the UAV category, we got the best product of the year uh, at CES. Congratulations. Thank you. So, when does this thing ship? We're shipping in the summer of this year, summer 2016, uh, and we'll be building distribution in 2016 after that. Thanks for talking with me. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, great.